In that Nigerian Senate holding brief for the federal government, we all know that at any point in time in any nation's history, new leaders emerge with new styles, with new programs. And I think it would be fair to this government, they have engaged organized labor immediately after the subsidy was removed. And we all know that those of us who know the history of labor negotiation in Nigeria, it is not so easy for the federal government to just announce a new salary wage without necessarily carrying out the state governments along. Because most of the states, up to today, I'm not sure whether most of them have even paid the 30,000 naira minimum wage. So all these things have to be taken into consideration. And I believe that uh, Ajaro was insisted on going on strike because to prove a point, that point that what the labor could not do in the, in the middle past two years, they have not been able to gather the, the workforce together. Yes, they have the right to strike at any point in time, but that negotiation must have been seen to be inconclusive, especially if the federal government failed to show up or meet its own part. Mm. The issue of uh, uh, pushing the effect, which we all felt, it rains everywhere. Everybody has to know that it has affected every living Nigerian, mm. everybody living here. It's going to be a process in which not only are they giving palliatives, palliatives like where I live, you'll be surprised that the people say in Ugo State, but the people said they organized a rally last week. They said they didn't want any palliative. What they wanted is to go, come and repair the road, for the government to come and repair their road so Fixing that they can, so that they can, infrastructure, so they can go about their normal At least that will boost the economy. Because they know that a bag of rice that we have given them today is not going to survive for one month. You go back to the old problem. Mm. So I would have expected the labor to be more, insistent more on giving value to the Naira. Because the issue of economy is what money can buy, not how much you are holding as your yeah, salary. Yeah. Okay. The value of pan sterling in even UK today, you can't believe that Agege bread, I have a cousin who lives in UK most of his life, just came back. Agege bread that they sell in UK, it's, to buy it now is about equivalent of 2,500 Naira. Mm. Things are also had all over the country. Yeah. So what we believe is that NSC should, be, should not unnecessarily overprice itself. Because as far as I'm concerned, I came here by public transport. And I didn't encounter any problem today. Okay. I have a. Uh, yeah, my, <laughs> right, my son uh, went to school today. Um,